Today we are looking at People Playground Inventions. So the very first invention is the Hover Boots. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably one of the most pointless things that I ever invented. One of the guys lost his leg. He is expected to make a full recovery. This one is like a gravity gun matrix. It pretty much just grabs anything in its line of sight. So I created this little hover pad to help people get up to the gravity guns. And as you can see, these things just do not give a fuck about your feelings. At all. Here's another little thing I invented to help with the gravity gun matrix. It's just a pretty much a springboard. Basically, these things are fucking brutal. And then we have the death machine. I think you can kind of get the idea based on the name. Um, these things are just savage. They will come into your house and just leave everything a fucking mess. I mean, these things are a real menace to society, to be honest. Nobody stands like that. It is a flying physics gun that literally fucking abducts people, dude. As you can see, again, it's just... I don't even know how to help these poor guys. Oh, God. Uh, wh what is... what is going on here? Uh, what it... This guy is just getting spun around. It's just flying around with this guy's leg or okay and then I invented something kind of similar uh, but with a mini gun on there instead of the uh, instead of the gravity gun I think I called it the street sweeper it just mows through anything on the ground uh, <laughs> geez This one we can call giant industrial piston punching machine. Uh, I created something that's kind of like a motion sensor boxing ring. If they go anywhere towards the edges, they just get fucking, they just get punched. They just get punched by giant industrial pistons. Uh, these ones are called death factories. It's just like a giant factory of deadly pistons, basically. And so, as you can see, it just got completely out of hand here. This is a death factory, okay? Here's the most extreme version of the death factory. And then here it is in slow motion. 